Well, that was a disaster. No, of course we're not giving up. We just had to find the right kind of sweetener for our sugary sweets. Let's see. Lemon meringue pine cones? Peanut butter and jellyfish? Oh, here's a good one. Candy lines. The candy lion tree grows in any terrain. They blossom once a year during the windy season, producing a light sugary fluff. Hmm, now we just have to find any terrain. I don't know, Pug. I can't help feeling like something is missing. Is there anything we haven't tried? Lemon juice? No, these are ingredients for sugar's gumdrops. <gasps> the gumdrops! They could be ruined without it! Sugar probably doesn't want to be interrupted. But I'm going over there anyway, so don't try to talk me out of it. Giggly! Wishes! Come on, those gumdrops are counting on us. Come on, Mouse. I know you're in there. I know you like cheese. Oh, I give up. Um, sugar? Candle? Hi. What's wrong? Isn't it obvious? My treats turned out terrible because I didn't follow the recipe and there's no time to fix it because the festival could be starting at any minute and now Mouse is missing and I don't know how to find her. Ugh, you think that's bad? I've got a kitchen full of frosted vegetables. <laughs> I guess working apart wasn't any better for us than working together. But at least when we're together, we're not all alone. And your treats aren't terrible. They just came out a little wobbly, which might be the way to solve one of your problems. How's that? Well, I bet Mouse isn't as jiggly as these gumdrops. So if we could get them all to jiggle at the same time, Mouse would be the only one standing still. Right. But how do we get them to do that? Ooh, I know. I know. I know. <laughs> like this. <laughs> Just in time. Look, the candy lines are blooming. Ooh, ah. Now we just have to find a way to get the blossoms down. But we've got to hurry. We barely have time to get home and make candy for the festival. Ah. We can't give up now, Monkey. I know we can do it. We just have to... Uh-oh. It's all blowing away! No! Wait, I'm not quite done. No! Really? Look! We got it to work! <sighs> Thanks, but it doesn't matter now. Uh-oh. What's wrong, Whirly? I wanted you all to have the best festival ever. But everything I've tried to do has gone completely wrong. Pomeranian, I think we got a situation. <gasps> Not everything. You got me and Peppy to figure out how to fix a machine we don't know anything about. Don't give up. Don't give in. That's the spirit. Win, win, win. And Crumbs is so excited. She's been practicing all day to be the best festival judge ever. When you're done, remember this. You can do it whatever it is and even candle and sugar are back to working together again. And it's all because you never gave up on us. And you're our friend, so we're not gonna let you give up on yourself. You're right, I'm not giving up. Not when we've got a festival to celebrate. Peppy, tell everyone the sugar's on the way. Hooray! <coughs> Dot, I'm gonna need your help, and we need to find Peanut. I have an idea. Finally, we get to go ballooning. There should be just enough time to squeeze in a short trip before the festival. And that'll be one more thing off your checklist. Peanut, wait, where are you going? I was about to take Elephant on a hot air balloon ride for his birthday. Do you mind if we come along? It's important. It's up to you, Elephant. Thanks, Elephant. Thanks, Peanut. Now I'm just going to need some kind of bucket. 
Perfect. Let's go. I think I'm ready, Mouse. My keen senses are finally up to the challenge of judging the festival of sugary sweets. Now we've just got to go over to Whirly's house and help with the decorations. Come on, Mouse. There! Do you see it? Fly in as close as you can. But not too close. They're very delicate. And the slightest breeze could disturb the candy lines. And we don't want to do that, right? Nope, because that's Dot's job. Go ahead, Dot! That's the signal. Here we go. She did it! Now it's our turn. Ready, monkey? Yay! It's working! You did it! We did it. Thanks, Peanut. Thanks, Elephant. Well, we didn't get to go for a relaxing hot air balloon ride, but we did get to go on an exciting hot air balloon rescue! That's a ride and an adventure rolled into one! Thank you all for pitching in and working so hard on the festival today. I know it hasn't always been easy. You're right about that. That's for sure. But it's still a whole lot better than when we are apart. So much better. So if I could ask you all one last favor. Sure, Absolutely. no problem. We've got a little last minute baking to do. And I brought enough candy lime fluff for everyone. Yes! This is the best thing that could possibly happen. <laughs> <laughs> Help yourself to some candied peanuts, courtesy of Peanut Victor. Dot, thank you for coming. I wouldn't miss it. And I brought star cookies. You're just in time. The mud pie eating contest is about to begin. On your marks, get set, go! <laughs> Looks like we have a winner. Woo! Yay! Yeah! Okay. Go, 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 go! Now it's time for the button ribbon. I judge Candle's cake to be completely scrumptious. Hooray! And Sugar's homemade gumdrops, so sweet. Huh? Mmm, so chewy and delicious. I wish I had enough button ribbons to give you a prize for every new flavor, Whirly. But I think we can all agree that your candy is so yummy and delicious that there's only one word to describe it. Sugary sweet. <laughs> I think that's two words. But the real winners are Giggly and Wishes. Not only do their little bit of everything mud pies taste like nothing I've ever tasted before, and everything I've ever tasted before, but they showed us that when you work together as a team, you make something really special. Giggly wishes you're the best. You put the sweet in the sweetness fast. Hip, hip, hooray! Hooray! <laughs> I told you we'd do something special for you today. Is there anything else you'd like to do to make your special day extra special? Nothing? Nothing at all? <laughs> Because usually you ask for fireworks. I can never forget the fireworks.